Well, it was only a matter of time, so I'm going to talk about the archery in Genshin Impact. This is a game that's been on my radar for a while, but I haven't got around to playing it, and then I was approached by them to make an ad, um, and I don't want to make an ad about something I've not played. So I downloaded the game and gave it a go, and I just wanted to talk about uh, the archery that Ember, the first character with a bow that you come across, does. This is not that ad, by the way. This is just me making content. First off, the basic mechanic. You've got, um, as in any self-respecting archery game, a thing where you hold an aim. This is a charge shot. If you hold it down for longer, it charges more. And in Ember's case, sets fire to things. I'm in my backyard. I'm not doing that. But pretty reasonable as archery things go. If you smack something in the head, it flies back. I like it. It's good. No notes. If you just mash the attack button, you get a bunch of quick shots, which are nowhere near as powerful or as accurate as your other attacks. And that is basically what speed shooting feels like a lot of the time. When it comes to the stance for the shooting, it's a little bit weird. She seems to hold the bow a bit like this, which is kind of front on. Not quite as powerful as a more sideways approach, but hey, all of her shots are magic. And as for the draw style, none of the characters in this game actually have a quiver. So they're just generating the arrow from the string like that. And if I could do that, that would be amazing. Seriously, I want magic arrows. I want magic arrows that appear when I shoot. It's like my favourite thing in fantasy archery. It is the fantasy for me as an archer, is to not have to worry about arrows. Also, for what it's worth so far, all the character designs are really cute, which makes like a huge change from the kind of edgy, oh, I can have a dark side kind of archer characters that you get in loads of fiction. I love it. I love it. The second thing in her kit is some kind of a decoy, which uh, can, enemies can target and eventually explodes. I like it. It's not a mechanic I've come across very much for Archer characters, but it's quite a cool one because it takes some of the heat off you so you can get your distance and shoot, especially in a game without a dodge mechanic. And then she has this more powerful ability that takes a little while to charge up, where she like shoots an arrow up in the air and then a volley of arrows fall down on the target. And the best way I can replicate it in real life is by basically just grabbing a handful of the things, pulling them up in the air, and watching them land. But my favourite thing so far about the archery in this game is the combos. And the animations that come with it are joyous. Because every shot involves some kind of step afterwards, which is terrible for accuracy, but at least things like this... You get a regular shot into a crouching shot, followed by a spinning shot, into a jump and then power slides through into something like that except of course that everything's on fire the honest non-ad verdict i actually do like it it's fun it's free it's pretty cute um it's not a stressful game to play so if you like stuff like that give it a go and don't forget to follow to see what happens when i discover the rest of the characters